go. All right, guys, and welcome back for another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. And here they are. We have expected for it to be Cell Saga because one, they're going to promote the movie. Well, at, during this time, the movie was supposed to come out um, in around what, 420 in Japan. So uh, this is where I think this is where they're going to promote the movie by having Gohan since he was in the main as the main uh, protagonist of the movie. So that makes a lot of sense here. But we have is Goku, who is going to be pretty much if you go into actually I'll look in deep into the uh, information on what they say. But uh, but first glance here. We're having a brand new Dokkan Fest, Super Saiyan Goku, and uh, I think it says a parent and childhood uh, in the information. So it's going to be a Goku slash uh, Gohan. So basically what they're going to be having is it's going to have a Goku and uh, an exchange uh, Goku. And then potentially the you're going to go into exchange Super Saiyan Gohan and then add the skill going into Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. And for the cell, what I'm predicting is that it's going to be imperfect cell. And then you're going to have to probably go into a normal transformation, um, you know, like like some kind of, you know, like so it's like a conditioned order in order to go into uh, second form cell or he will just go into um, what you would call it straight to perfect form cell, which that could be really interesting to see. But I, I do think this cell will go into the second form cell and then go into the uh, cell perfect form, which that'll be interesting to see because there are um, really interesting um, animations that they haven't used from the anime where uh, Imperfect Cell absorbs 17 and that'd be kind of cool. And also the the iconic scene where uh, second form cell absorbs 18 and then he powers like, like he glows up and then has like the uh, field energy around him and then and then goes uh, um, and, and the powers up or transforms into a perfect cell so i expect that confirmation into the animations and i'm very curious to see what uh the s the sorry the always teas are going to be like in the leader scale uh from what it looks like if we go into air dog i start with the boy air dog on here uh if we go into the description for the uh goku here parent and child fighting for the fate of the earth challenge a sense uh a, i think a sense or transcends i guess power created by the bond between parent and child Stay tuned for a future uh, for a new super fierce battle event. So basically, this pretty much uh, hints that we're gonna get a Goku slash or exchange Gohan uh, going into Super Saiyan uh, to Gohan. So this is where I've been wanting to have a parent or a parent or parental bond category for the longest time. Um, I was predicting that for Mod Vegeta because he's, you know, that kind of fits him in a way because he was uh, going to die for his child, basically, and, and his wife. So that kind of fit into the parental bond category for the Mod Vegeta. But instead, they actually um, changed that to having Goku and Gohan as potentially becoming the parental bond category leader. So it's going to have all Trunks's, all Kid Trunks's, future Saga Trunks's. Um, it's going to have Vegeta's. It's gonna have all Gohans. It's gonna have pretty much all Goten. Uh, potentially Goten's gonna be in it for sure because he's you know the father of Goku and Vegeta. So that makes kind of sense. Or if they don't, then that's kind of weird. Um, another one that that I can think of as a child and uh, and, and sorry, a child and a parent is King Colt and Mecha Frieza, and also Frieza units as well. And also I can definitely see uh, Cooler also be in this category. So this category is gonna be amazing because it's gonna have. Golden Frieza, all Frieza's basically, full power Frieza, of course, all Gokus, all Gohans, all Gotens, all uh, teen uh, Gohans, and uh, all, all, pretty much all, every version of Trunks's, all Vegeta's, and what, who other else is a parent um, in the, oh, um, Hercule and Videl, so Videl and Hercule are going to be in here, so that's another category for Videl, pretty cool, actually, another one that I can think of in my head is, I think, who's also a child, I mean, if, if the Grand Priest wasn't here, the, the, you've been great. But unfortunately, we and you know, the, uh, and the Grand Priest will not be here. So unfortunately, um, we don't have we and joining in this uh, category. But I can definitely think a lot of other things. Uh, who is? I mean, we could definitely what's no because because we because uh, we we don't, we don't know garlic Jr. well garlic's uh you know juniors and his father, but he wasn't there. So um, who could also be in this? So. Frieza's King Cole. Oh, Bardock, Bardock, my bad. Bardock. Oh, yeah, Bardock is going to be here, of course. Rad is going to be here, of course. Uh, who else is going to be here? Uh, Paragus and Broly is going to be here uh, from the Broly movie. And also Z Bro is going to be here as well. So this category is going to be very, very good. 
uh, for if they are going to do a parent uh, parental bond uh, category. And, I, and definitely, I can see this becoming uh, a 2% leader skill, so 170 across the board, and potentially they could... Uh, Goku will be probably Goku's family uh, for... Uh, so a parental bond and, and Goku's family, just like the opposite of the uh, Int Majo Jita, who was um, Majo Buu Saga, and then he was uh, Vegeta's family. And so I do think they're going to be buffing probably at least for this Goku and Gohan. Hybrid Saiyans? That makes more sense, actually. Or they could do is um, Parental Bond or some kind of uh, Andre Cell Saga, potentially. And then um, having Goku's family or Hybrid Saiyan. So that could, you know, buff the Gohan, potentially. Or and, or that could be... You know, actually, I do think it will be Goku's family for sure. But I'm not sure what the 30% uh, of the buff will be for... Uh, for this unit here. For Cell, um, it could be actually, I'm not sure for Cell actually. Uh, Cell could be an artificial life forms category at leader scale and androids. Um, Cell is gonna probably gonna be the 2% leader scale for androids. Um, so from him, I can definitely see him being, um, let me see here, regeneration probably. So a re re regeneration category. Slash or and also an of artificial life forms category one seven across the board or target Goku. Uh, actually, no, 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 he doesn't really target Goku, but he only targets uh the androids because he has to find them to go into the perfect form. So he'll probably be regeneration and artificial life forms and two percent and the third percent to all stats for androids so that way. So uh, it could work with um, with actually, let me see here, regeneration maybe. Auto absorption, maybe? No, probably no. Maybe transformation boost potentially. Ooh, maybe transformation boost and artificial life forms and two percent leader skill for the androids or androids and then and then uh, and thirty percent to artificial life forms. Hmm, maybe. Uh, I'm not sure actually. Or they could do it as android slash shell saga again, which I don't really. Uh, I mean, I guess they really need it as is is a new extreme android shell saga leader skill across the board so that i guess that makes sense and also um since it's a cell saga uh two units could get an easy a and uh, if you already know on top of your head it's going to be the lr agio gohan and the incel so that's going to be really interesting if they are going to lr easy a the super saint uh gohan and slash in the uh cell here because one they are very slow i, I would say gohan is a more um more viable unit than Cell. Cell could be uh, re really more uh, viable and reliant for uh, for battle road stages. But um, if we go into the Gohan here, uh, just real fast and, and talk about why, or you know, it's pretty much hundred percent, or I would say fifty fifty right now that they are going to uh, easy a the LR uh, Super Saiyan Gohan. So we go over here real fast. Um, if we look in the meta right now, he came out in twenty nineteen. So that was like what two years ago, right? Two years ago, probably three years actually. Three years ago, he came out, and he is still one of the best, I would say, most viable units used until this day. He does stack attack and defense, or he, he only stacks his defense, which is pretty nice. So, what I'm gonna think that they're gonna give him the Kamehameha category to 178 across the board, and then, or actually 180 actually, because if you uh, look at the Super Saiyan 4 Goku and the uh, SGR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, uh, they were 180 across the board, and I think they gave the um. The model typing 130. So this guy's gonna be 180 to Kamehameha category, and then 130 to the mono AGL. And he could, he'll probably stack attack and defense if they are going to easy a him. So that way, so that, so that way he can be more viable for longer events. And he and then he'll probably do a lot of damage here. So what are they gonna do with them? Is that probably they're going to give him uh, attack and defense 158 to stats, uh, and then probably gonna give him more probably in his in his passive probably like in like an evade or more guard out. If he had guard out attacks, that would be amazing. Like this guy would be super amazing. Because right now he has nothing that would, you know, benefit from the because he has nothing. He has no dodging, he has no criticals, uh, he has like nothing that will make him like you know unique as a uh 22 2022 Dokkan Fest meta unit. So they need to make him really, really powerful, probably like having some dodges. Maybe a mid chance to do an additional super attack or high chance to crit or something that will make him pretty uh, very viable these days because now that uh, he's not that great, he's not going to be useful for many. I mean, he's still useful for, for long events, but other than that, that's just, just as useful as just using him for long events. But he does, you know, slowly rise his defense so slowly, so maybe potentially 
with his easy a he could build up his defense from even more higher so that would be kind of great maybe greatly stack, stack attack and defense or just really start rising his defense maybe that'd be great but other than that uh can't wait for this guy to get his easy a um if they're ever going to uh you know change the conditions for this guy i would probably would say um make it easier to go into super saiyan 2 gohan uh, but other than that, I don't think they're going to change a single thing about Gohan because if I remember correctly, I, I don't think they have to change a single thing about a, well, just minor changes, like just a little bit of changes, um, with their conditions. But other than that, um, I don't know if they are going to change an access skill. Oh yeah. Uh, the, whatchamacallit, if we go in and talk about the int UI Goku, who has that, who has, actually, no, he has not access skill. So never mind. So I'm not sure what they're going to do with that access skill, if they're going to change the conditions, but hopefully that is more easier to go into the Super Saiyan 2 Gohan form. And also, if you go into the Super Saiyan 2 form, he's actually pretty, pretty powerful. So imagine him getting attack plus 58% and then 58% or 120 for defense or probably around like, actually, I think this will keep, I think this will be kept, but uh, like an unconditional attack and defense plus 50% and defense, that'd be great. Uh, maybe in a guarantee, as long as it's a super attack, that's a, okay. Uh, he also has a guaranteed uh, launching a super attack if he's facing multiple enemies, which that should be good. Uh, also, maybe maybe having more defense on this uh, when uh, getting an ATK super probably, or you know having a Super Saiyan at least on the team or a Goku's family on the team. That that'd be kind of great. So this guy is in a lot of categories. He's Hyper Saiyan's full power, transfer your boost. Goku, uh, Goku's family, youth, Super Saiyans, Android Soul Saga, Kamehameha, Bottom Master Disciple, uh, Super Saiyan Two, Exploding Rage. Uh, rapid growth, a lot of struggle, miraculous awakening, heavenly events, master to evolution, interested will, battle fate, and beyond super saiyan. So this guy um needs at least a uh an easy a for star to become even even good for you know for the red zone. So I would not be surprised if we get this guy as the first part for the easy a and the second part uh in cell for the easy a. So let, let's go over and see what cell does. If we go and check cell, the incel, the LR. He doesn't really do much in the space form or his perfect form cell uh, at all. He just he just only gains what more attack and defense if the if you uh, if you are low on HP. Remember correctly. Uh, let me see here. He does <laughs> he does nothing on on the 12 key super, but he does rise his uh, attack on the 8 key super, which is okay, I guess. But he he only has a defense attack and defense plus 80 percent. That's about it. And then he only gains defense up when the uh, the more HP of the greater. The more uh the more HP remaining the greater the defense boost that's about it so i'm pretty sure that they're gonna buff this up to either 120 or 150 and then probably they're gonna be having this to having attack and defense uh rise up to 80 percent or 100 percent uh the more you know the hp the greater boost and the attack and this one here they're gonna give them probably key plus one and attack plus one percent per per into the enemy probably and something more probably like you know getting another uh critical hit potentially more uh damage stats potentially something like that but if we have to go into the perfect cell here who is actually i do think he's really good but he needs a little something here maybe like a rise attack and defense for one turn also as well greatly he's a rising attack and defense for one turn here on a 12k super um he recovers he fully recovers hp uh key plus four which is really nice uh attack and defense to 120 so I do think this will bump them to either to 180 or 200%. That'd be pretty nice. And then they're gonna give him probably more attack, probably I would say 40%. And then probably this one will be probably at a 60%. And hopefully that he does, you know, uh whatchamacallit, for right hand south having a actually I want this guy to become a rainbow key spirit changer for himself because he needs key. This guy needs key in order to do a lot of damage. So hopefully this guy or like you know change the uh, i guess tech key spirits into nk spirits potentially or changing the field into nk spirits so that way so, so we can get the full potential of this guy with getting eight or more key spirits uh maybe a guaranteed crit or you know uh mid chance to do a crit or an additional super tag that'd be pretty nice um also this guy is his active skill is one of the worst active skills in the game for condition wise condition wise one because one it can be activated only if it's one enemy for starting from the third turn after evolution what is that <laughs> what is that because by then either you already won by then or you die by then so either they have to fix that to either using it on their first turn that'd be great that'd be super perfect with me but like i said i'm not sure if they are going to fix the conditions for the after skills i pretty much they're going to keep the same because remember correctly the after skills are pretty much the same so 
that is the only, the only thing that I hate about about Koski is that they're not going to change any of the conditions for uh, the Athens Club. Because remember correctly, when they first came out back in the day, we were all complaining about the conditions. So hopefully, um, if they did easy these guys, please, Akatsuki, if you're listening, or if you if you did listen back in the old days, please change the conditions for these guys. That would make this guy very, very perfect for sure. But other than that, I think that's about it that we have for information for uh, so far. That that we have is Golden Week for both both for Global and JP, and it's going to be a Goku slash Gohan and an Imperfect Cell going into Super, uh, sorry, Super Saiyan 2 Cell. Ugh. Second form Cell into Perfect Form Cell. And I'm actually very curious to see about the OSTs. They're going to be a bomb, and we're going to get probably an instant transmission Goku. That would be kind of cool, actually. For the LR Part 2, uh, they could probably do anything. Um, they could probably do an LR Super Trunk, potentially, or an LR... Um, Gohan and Goku, if they really want to do that, you know, like, you know, like the, um, a uh, Goku and Piccolo potentially, they could do that, or they could do is a standalone LR 16, or, uh, they could do is an LR Super Vegeta that has an after scale going, uh, doing the Final Flash. That would be really good, actually. Uh, but if I'm gonna, going to be a betting guy, I think we're gonna get is LR by guys Goku for sure, or the LR part two for sure. So, yeah, guys, be excited. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna go gonna go deep into this banner because one, global is not gonna get a discounted uh, multis here, and also they're not gonna get tickets. So that that's the only issue about this banner is that they're not gonna have no uh, discounted multis and no tickets for this. So I might just skip this banner. Uh, but depending on the information and everything, I might summon this banner. Probably will do a, a couple of summons on this banner, and hopefully that, that I can get the Gohan because me personally, I am uh, a lover for. Super Saiyan to go on He's actually pretty amazing in this uh, saga here. So, all right, guys, uh, that's about it for the news. And hopefully, you guys, will be excited for the next Golden Week unit. And it's going to be Gohan, uh, Goku slash Gohan, and, and Perfect Cell going into Perfect Cell. So, hopefully, uh, these units are going to be great. And hopefully, that their leader skills are fantastic. And as well, the and the number one thing about me for sure is the OSTs and the animations. Hopefully, they are very, very good. So, all right, guys, be excited. And of course, if you watch the video, please leave a like and also comment down below. Are you excited for a uh, Cell Saga celebration for this, you know, for, for this year's Golden Week? And good luck.